Good morning. Welcome to the PWOD. Happy. I had to ask Tuesday. Chris. Tuesday. I said, what day of the week is Two today? minutes a little behind, but we're here. And we have our black rifle, extra, ca extra caffeinated coffee. But let me tell you, I'm super, super excited. Did Bridget because, give us this? Um, yes, she did. Or not, somebody did. Who no, gave it? No, you ordered that particular no. coffee. But Bridget oh, yeah. did give us a specific. She gave us Black Rifle Coffee, bold. and I absolutely love it. Black and bold. Bold black. Black bold. I'm not sure. But this <laughs> caffeinated that. coffee? Now, this one he got in from the actual company. Show them your shirt. This isn't it. It said, this is from Grunt Style, and I love this shirt. It says, if you believe in it, then fight for it. And it's a secular shirt, but let me tell you. It's a military you, shirt. I absolutely love that shirt. Whenever I saw Chris wearing it this morning, I was like, oh Ooh. my gosh. That is such a shirt that we can apply to Christian life. If you believe in it, then are you going to fight for it? Let, I mean, come on, Jesus. Come on, Jesus. I don't As know if I want to jump through a wall or just lay down on the floor. I don't know. I have I've been had, up since five. Okay, I have had two hours of sleep because I, I didn't go to bed until 5.30 a.m. I stayed up in a place of intercession and prayer. Have you ever been in those moments um, where the enemy has, has a full-on assault and you've got to pray and you've got to contend and you have to fight for what you believe in? Well, guess what? That's what I did. Well, forgive me for yawning because I haven't, <laughs> I slept, but anyway, it's been two days of uh, very late nights and uh, woke Pray. up this morning and did legs. What'd you say? I said, well, praise God. Oh yeah, praise God. And so I woke up this morning. Uh, five o'clock, did my leg workout, prayed, sought the Lord. Uh, Going to do some more seeking of the Lord today. I've got some stuff the Lord showed me or told me I need to read and study, and I'm going to do that. So, if you're ready for the how do we call this very important prophetic word of the day? No, that's not how it's called. It. It's called special announcement. If you're ready <laughs> for the special announcement, <laughs> he's so cute, y'all. Then you need to share and tag this and get oh. it out there and say, guys, you have to hear this. Let me go ahead no. and say hello to a couple of the people. We've got Sarah, we've got Connie, we've got Michelle, we've got Jim, we've got Gary, we've got Gwen, Dana Sarn, Shelly Brown, Alex. With Shelly, we also have Greg and we April, have Christian and we have Alexis. Because we know yes. they're all watching it together. Yes, they are. They are a team watching from one link. One link. So it They cracks. are linked in together. They are. So if you're ready for it this morning, get it out there because we have some important information that we are going to share with you this morning. And it is courage. Bigly. It's what? Courage. It's not just huge. It's courage. Courage. I've and never heard that bigly. word. Bigly. Now, I have heard that. Yeah. Sonia Wiley. Chris Wiley. I love you guys. Show sure enough do. I love you. Had that. a great conversation with... Um, Jack and Sheila Jack Harper. Jack and Sheila Harper about you guys. We loved y'all. And they were they just were like, we love how y'all love Chris and Sonia. And said, well, we love them anyway. So, um, what a great time. So, all right. Go with me to 3 John, verse 5 and 8. What chapter? Chapter, it's 3 John. <laughs> Third John verses five through eight, and we're yes. going to read this together out of the hey, New Donna. Living New Living Translation this morning. Okay, morning, Donna. Yay! I'm glad y'all got to meet. Okay, dear friend, you are you are being faithful to God when you care for the traveling teachers who pass through, even though they are strangers to you. They have told the church here of your loving friendship. So please continue providing for such teachers in a manner that pleases God, for they are traveling for the Lord, and they accept nothing from people who are not believers. So we ourselves should support them so that we can be their partners as they teach the truth. Yes. Big announcement. The Lord is guiding Davy and I into another dimension um, of Chris Brooks Ministries. was So now I said that one called CBM. And in CBM, we are about to launch something. That we will not be sharing right now. And we're not going to share right now. But we are launching it on July the 23rd and the 24th here in Chattanooga exclusively to our partners. 
If you are one of our partners, you will get a private invite. We will not give these details via social media. They will not be put on our website and they will not be public. So it is going to be partner exclusives. And we are so pumped and super excited for what God is about to do in and through and for our partners. Amen. This is huge, y'all. So July is going to be the first ever partner meeting meeting for CBM. That being said, if you're a partner, you need to go ahead and get those dates set in. Uh, It'll be a Friday night and to Saturday be here morning. For a Friday night and a Saturday morning. So go ahead and tell work you need off. Go ahead and get ready. Find you your hotel and come be we, we have booked the location. We've already got this the location. Morning. Um, it is locked in. We're not going to, again, publicize that, but it is within this local region. Mm -hmm. So, um, again, it's going to be a Friday night and a Saturday morning. So, those of you that have watched the PWOD and we've been talking about partnering and you haven't partnered yet, now's the time to partner. Because every partner that we have, we will be doing a special Friday night surf dates again, please. July the 23rd. And July the 24th. Now, I'm going to go ahead and throw this out there because, again, we can't, couldn't find any other dates that were feasible for us to do it. And it ended up being my birthday. That's all. So, that was by accident. The, but let me just say this. Friday night, Friday night I'll be preaching his, on my birthday it again. It is his birthday. <laughs> which I have for the past 20-something years have preached on my birthday. Yes. So... The July the 23rd, July the 24th, we are having the first ever partner meeting to discuss, to discuss vision that partners, you are going to be involved in this vision. This is not like something- Like actively connected. Actively connected. This is going to be a huge undertaking for the ministry of where we are going, what we are doing, and Amen. where God is directing us as John states as a traveling man and woman of God, being sent by the hey, Lord. Teresa. Now, I'm not going to go into great detail. What is this going to be? Um, we're going to be catering this. There will we're, be... We're not going to go too far into detail because we don't have all that locked in Right, yet. right, right, right. But this will be a time of fellowship. Yes. Getting to know one another. Mm -hmm. I don't... This is not... Don't look at this as a conference. This is not a conference. This is an intimate get to really know each other, sit down and break bread and receive the word and the vision of the yes. Lord, okay? Yes, we want We want to love on you as much as you have loved on us over these past years, and we want to bless you. Yes. Um, the focus of this entire thing is going to be discipleship. The entire focus will be about discipleship. So, that being said, I want you to just go ahead and start preparing yourself and getting ready that I will be preparing to speak into your lives, um, Davey and I both, as well as casting the vision of what it is that we're doing and where we're going. Um, we want it here in Chattanooga because this is our home and we want you to come be a part of our home. I, I wish oh, we had Joseph Combs. He kind of gave an idea. I don't know if it was meant to be an idea. Communion. Yeah, I saw that. that's so cool. I don't know. I, we'll see. I wish we had a big enough home to put everybody in, but we don't. Mm -hmm. um, I'd love to be able to do that, but we're, we're just going to go with what we have. Uh, my spiritual father will be there, and he yesterday we met with him and got confirmation on what we are doing, and he gave. Uh, he said, "Whichever church you want, because he's got two. He says you can have well, whatever." Well, now you you're want. giving location and stuff. Please stop. All right, I'm gonna stop. Okay, please stop. I'm gonna stop. So, <laughs> the word. Thank you. Mm -hmm. John says, "Friends, I want to thank you for being so faithful to God." for taking care of the teachers who pass through, for taking care of us. Yes. Because of your partnership, your prayers and your finances gives us the ability to do the PWOD every single day, Monday through Friday, mm -hmm. go minister and minister here in our own hometown, which you are a part of that fruit. Yes. 
And it says here, even though we were strangers at a time, mm -hmm. because of the Lord, he has drawn us together as kingdom family. Yes. This John, John then says that the others or the church has talked about your loving friendship mm -hmm. towards this ministry. Now, please continue here, providing for such teachers in a manner that pleases God. Mm -hmm. I'm going to go ahead and, and throw this out there. No, I'm not. See, I'm going to wait on the Holy Ghost here. Nope. Okay. I can't go too far into that. Thank you, Holy Spirit. We are traveling for the Lord and accepting nothing from non-believers, but we live upon the kingdom body coming together, all right? So we ourselves should support those that are partners because they teach the truth. Mm -hmm. We partner with ministries. Um, let me tell my partners this, and those that aren't, it's time for you to become a partner. Get ready to start moving. Mm -hmm. Get ready to start being sent and seeing discipleship go to a whole nother level. Um, again, I cannot get ahead of myself and, and, and I get overzealous at times and want to share every detail. Really? So I'm having to <laughs> calm down. Now you do as well. But I at least have the uh, the the unction to stop myself. You just, you, you just say it, and then I have to cover it. So, oh my goodness! <clears throat> hey, let me let me tell you. I promise you this this time on the twenty third and the twenty fourth of July is going to be a lot of fun, especially if Chris and I are sitting there chit chatting. Well, you're with you guys. going to have a live piwad, is what you're going to get. It's going to be so much fun. A live piwad and lots <laughs> of hugs. And you know, if you're going to do anything with Davy Brooks, you're going to have coffee. Yeah, I'm just saying there'll be coffee. There might. Um, he says there's going to be food, but if there's no food, there'll definitely be coffee. Now we. The reason that I want to do a Friday night and a Saturday morning is so that you can come here and rest Friday night or have it Friday night, have a breakfast Saturday morning and a small teaching that we're going to try to be done by noon, give you the rest of the day that if you decide that you need to travel back home, that you'll have that time to do it or relax here in Chattanooga, take in the city. And if you want to come to church with us Sunday morning, we want you to come with us and be a part of a Sunday morning service at our home and experience what, where we go. Mm -hmm. and, and just take the time for all of us. And I, listen, when I say take the time, take the time. Yeah. Not get in a hurry. Conferences are hurry, 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 hurry. Get to the next service, get to the next thing. Get, not doing it. Not doing it. Mm -mm. I wanna focus on you. Mm -hmm. I wanna focus on your life, your marriage, your single mm -hmm. relationship, your family where God is leading us and how you yeah. are going to play a pivotal role in where the Lord is leading us. So this morning's PWOD, read this again, 3 John 5 through 8 in the New Living Translation. Hear from the Lord, prepare your hearts, get ready, come ready, um, be prepared in all ways, and we're going to have an incredible time. So there will be an email coming out very shortly. If you're not a partner, another reason for doing this is we're only talking to partners. If you have ever heard me preach the message on agreement. And it will be our current partners. Yeah. Those it's active partners. Active partners. Yes. Because here's why. I mean people to come into agreement with me. Yes. And... If those that aren't partners, if they have not, as we bought in, mm -hmm. meaning they got skin in the game, are not going to understand this. Desley, love y'all. Oh, I can't wait to see y'all. So, trip partners, yay. So here we go. I love you, Desley. This is pivotal for where the church is going mm -hmm. and what is going to happen in the coming future. As we, we have heard from the Lord. We believe that this God idea that has been downloaded to oh, us is something that has not been done 
in a very, very, very long time and has only ever been done by a few. Very few. Ministers across the globe. Um, and we believe that God has given us a very specific assignment that we want to join and link arms with our partners. Love you too, Desmond. As catalysts Richard to King. see the kingdom of God advanced. And it just so happened that I am wearing my Advance the Kingdom shirt by the Chumneys. I love oh, Rachel. we got to get the Chumneys up here. Well, they're not they on are this. Coming. They are not on this right now. I know, but they, they will be. They are some of our best friends on the planet. Best. They are pastors love out them. in Florida. Um, and we absolutely love adore them. them. And so, anyway, back to advancing the kingdom. We know that whenever you join with this kingdom assignment, that there is going to be extravagant fruit mm. to those that want to see the kingdom of God advance. Let me give you just a tidbit. What does the kingdom of God being advanced truly mean? Discipleship. Chris touched on discipleship. He may teach for a little bit more on discipleship. Maybe, maybe not teach today, it. but I'm going to. This week, because next week, let me do a reminder, we will not be on the PWOD next week. We may be on there Monday on Memorial Day, but Tuesday through maybe. Saturday, we will not be on there. We are taking our family to a vacation. Yay. Yay. Praise the to Lord. To the beach. He loves I'm the beach. I'm excited. He loves the beach. Don't you love the beach? He hates the beach. <laughs> he hates the beach. But I have just to this go. this side of hell, a bunch of naked people laying out on sand. I just, oh my gosh, what did you just say? You heard me. Oh my gosh. I love just hearing the crashing waves and the silence. I just, I need, to, I need the noise to stop. Do you ever just need the noise to stop? I just Wading wanna... out in, in whale pee. Bless it. There's a swimming pool. We'll get in the swimming pool. Mm. I just... <laughs> it's just a bathtub for big folks. All it is. Oh, my God. Heather, Mark, love you guys. All right. Brenda. Okay, so back to discipleship. This is her vacation. Mine comes in November. So, I, I, November's my anniversary. Yeah, well, that's where my vacation comes in. <laughs> oh, bless what is God. your vacation in November? I'll show you real quick. What are you doing? Look at in there, baby. Okay. So, Switch this back. I'm trying to say something. So right, if you would it, stop, I'm hoping that he'll teach on discipleship this week because what real advancement of the kingdom of God looks like is discipleship. Discipleship is messy. Discipleship is exhausting. Discipleship is annoying. Discipleship is offensive. Discipleship gets in people's business. You can't show me anywhere in the word of God where Jesus did not get into the business of the disciples. But the church, there's, there's so much anemic discipleship that is taking place across the globe that we feel a mandate to really bring some truth to this. Amen. So stay connected to the PWOD this week. Mark partners, it down. Partners, get ready. Those that aren't partners, become one. Yes. Become a partner. You've already been thinking about it. You've already been praying about it. You've already asked the Holy Ghost about it. Now just pull the trigger and do it. Come be a part of this God-ordained now season assignment for the vision of what the Lord is about to do. And let me give you the information. It's on our website, chrisbrooksministries.com. We would prefer, whether you are giving by debit, credit card, or check, that you do it all through our website because it is so much easier logged. Um, if you do need to send a check, our P.O. Box information is on our website. But again, you can give a check through our website. So we'd rather you do that if you're able oh, to because it helps with administration. This partner meeting will be RSVP. We have to know immediately. So please don't be that church body that waits to the last minute. Because for us to get everything that we need to do, get the right volunteers and the right people, because we, I mean, it's just me, Davey, and Faith, and Grant here. So we've got to have the right <laughs> and people the and volunteers, which they can't do check. But they're so, so cute. Well, who cares? Do y'all want to meet Bentley? That's enough. Let's pray. Yay. Father, we love you and praise you. We thank you for this day. God, we thank you for vision and the assignment that you yes. have casted upon our lives. And I thank you for those yes. that are coming into agreement with us and saying, yes, yes, we want to be a part of this and we want to help advance the kingdom of God in our areas. So we accept Yes. The invitation with joy and gladness yes, and be, to be ready to be imparted into to then go out and to minister and love people to Jesus. 
We thank yes. you. We praise the Lord for you. And we cannot wait to see you coming soon. We'll be back on here tomorrow morning. Yes. Someone said something very prophetic, and I absolutely loved it. They said vitamin C, S-E-A. So it builds your immunity to go to the ocean. That's just... Thank you. Thank that's, you. That's, you know... What thank is that? you. What hey, is that chicken Gwen. soup for the soul that, you know what Gwen, that is? That's thank called you toilet bowl that. reading. That's no, no, toilet no, 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 bowl no. reading. The beach just <laughs> does the body good. Okay. Love y'all. Uh, if it doesn't challenge you, it won't change you. Of course. We'll see. And if you believe in it, you'll fight for it. Again, this is a secular you shirt from Grudge Style. For it. All I got to do is put a CBM on the logo. On it I'm telling time. you, that is my new favorite shirt. Y'all I love you guys. We'll see you in the morning.